This I wanna nail sports to the one Top blog or top YouTube channel No matter which sports here we got it covered Subscribe and hit the notification bell What's up sports to the bone family? What's up? How are you guys doing? Welcome back to another video Alright so yeah it's now one apiece West Indies went down to England in the second T20 match of the series I must say that it was indeed a pleasure doing a watch along with you guys you know for those who were not on you know I'm just going to quickly do a recap and upload this video so you guys can hear exactly how it went down but you know West Indies it was basically much of the same thing yesterday we went out we dominated in the first T20 today was back to business as usual we eventually lost the game by one run you understand it might sound close but it was, I can assure you, it wasn't because of the batsmen or the, or the top order batsmen that you expect to score runs. It was because of, a, of, a, of a, you know, outstanding innings from Romario Shepard and um, Akil Hussein, who really batted well in the latter part there. It was the same sort of high-risk approach that gave us, the, that gave us um, the excitement, yes, but that eventually led to us losing. You understand, we conceded, we soaked up a whole lot of dot balls, whole lot of dot balls. So I'm just going to go through the scorecard quickly for you guys so you can know exactly who performed and, and, and where we fell short. But before we go down into that, just going to ask you to go right ahead, hit that subscribe button if you have not yet subscribed. Also make sure that you leave a like and drop a comment. So it was England that batted first and they were able to get all the way up to 170 71 sorry 171 is what they were able to get and as i said we lost by one run so we ended on 170 for eight well one good thing is that or one good news is that we weren't bowled out you understand <laughs> you know but um yeah let, let me let me give you let me give you um how it went uh so bowling for us we had um we had Fabian Allen, he got a couple of wickets, you know, he was, he was, he was taken to the cleaners though. You know, he ended up with two wickets. Uh, he got two for 50. Jason Hola got two for 25 from his four. Uh, Pollard got one for 32. Shepard got one for 26. Cottrell got one for 23. No, we started off really well, you know, for those who didn't see the game. The first over, Cottrell gave away only six runs. And then Jason Holder came on and I think Jason Holder gave away something like one run. And, you know, Polar decided that it would have been smarter. I don't know the plan that he was working with, but he took off uh, Cottrell and Holder at the same time. Brothin, Allen and, um, and Hussein, you understand? And things didn't really go well. You know, um, Allen eventually took two wickets and a catch was put down. You know, I uh, think of, I think it was Billings. I don't remember who, but a catch went down. But generally speaking, I, I wasn't a fan of how the, the, the plan or how we worked that plan. You understand? So, uh, scoring for the, for the English, Jason Roy had 45 from 31. Tom Banton got 25 from 18. Vince got 4 from 4. Moen Ali got 31 from 24. And Chris Jordan, once again, like he did yesterday, sort of swinging the willow at the latter part, getting 27 from 15. You understand? So those were the guys that stood out for us. In the field, we were sloppy. I don't know if it is a case of us using too much of our brain cells yesterday. You know, because the first game, it was a clean, clean performance. Bowling, batting, feeling. But today was back to usual. We saw um, Bravo putting down what we could call an opportunity. Poor and putting down catch. Ball beating feelers. All sort of madness. It was just total madness out there on the field. You know, just as how we, they played well yesterday and we commended them, today they did not perform well. So we are going to critique, we are going to criticize what happened today. I know that some of my listeners will say, well, yesterday you praised, yesterday you praised them. So is it that you're bashing them now? Because we do reviews and commentary based on performance. So yesterday they had a clean day. It was a perfect day basically. Today, there are a whole lot of things that went wrong and we need to uncover them. The way in which the batsmen got out. So yeah, let, let us look at our batting. As I said, we went close to the target, but it was no thanks to the so-called specialist batsmen in the team. Brandon King, he didn't score. He got out um, LBW of an umpire's call. Right? Um, Shea Hope, once uh, he was run out, he got run out. Right? Ran down and um, Jan Puran was there and he got run out. Puran, 24 from 22. 
So you could call it a fail again. Bravo. He got trapped in front by Adul Rashid, 23 from 20. So a couple of these, two of these guys got starts. Puran and Bravo got starts, right? Pollard came in, he was trapped by Rashid. Also, hit on the back leg. Plum in front. Jason Hola advanced down the pitch, but into Moen Ali, slapped the ball right back in Moen Ali's hand. It was actually a good catch. Just like when um, Fabian Allen took a good catch, um, you know, it was a good catch. It was a good catch there. I can't, I can't knock, knock him there. Could have gone over the bowler's head, but it was a good catch. And and then the, the, the batting, the, the batting came after that. You know, it was after that that the guys, that, that we saw we, we saw some batting. You know, Akil Hussein and, um, and Romario Shepard, those two guys, they batted to the end. And, you know, they were able to finish off on 44 uh, and 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 uh, 44 and well, both of them got 44. Shepard got 44 from 28. Aki Hussein's 44 was even more beautiful. 44 from 16. You understand? Hit the last ball for six. You know, so you only what I think we wanted what seven runs to win. The bowler came in bold. Saki Mamu, that is, he, he got hit for six. You understand? But he, too late was the cry. The whole lot of that balls that 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 um that that we soaked up really really made the thing made the thing look away. You understand? Too many that balls we, we we are giving up my viewers and subscribers. So, uh, England England levels the series now. So we will we will be looking for the third game on Wednesday, and we will look into see we will be looking to see if we can go out there and perform. I uh, didn't give you the fall off wickets for England. Let me give you the fall off wickets. So. Uh, 36 before we got the first wicket, 36 for 1, 40 for 2, 101 for 3, 114 for 4, 116 for 5, 147 for 6, 162 for 7, 164 for 8, right? That is how it went for, for them and then they got all the way up to 171. Now in terms of how our wicket fell, uh, the, 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 the Topley, Topley, Topley bow arm started off, that's it, the the, the new bowler that they had there, the left arm pace bowler, was getting the ball to Nipparoni. Bowled four overs, one wicket for 18 runs. Saki Mamodi was on the expensive side, four overs, 45 runs. Uh, Moen Ali took three for 24 from his four overs. Rashid got two for 24 from four, while Chris Jordan finished off with one for, uh, one for 39. You understand? Uh, this is how we lost our wicket. 3 for 1 when Brandon King went. 6 for 2, Shea Hope. 47 for 3, Puran. 50 for 4, Pollard. 55 for 5, Bravo. 57 for 6, Holder. 67, 65 for 7, right? Odin Smith. 98 for 8, Fabian Allen. And that is the last wicket that we lost there. So from 98 for 8, um, Akil Hussein and uh, Romario Shepard, they were able to carry us all the way up to 170 and we only lost by one run. So those are the two guys that we can say hats off to. They tried, you know, they tried both with bat and ball. The two of them, Akil Hussein did, did his thing with the ball and he came back, did his thing with the bat. Romario Shepard did his thing with the ball, came back with the bat just the same. What is wrong with the other guys? Consistency is the thing, you know, yesterday we performed well. Right, and we, 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 we gave them the props, but that is it. We want people to be consistently performing so we can say, Alright, the team is definitely moving in the right direction. Don't want it to be a case where we have the first, you know, you win a game and then you lose one and then you your, your four match after that, you win a next one. You know, them sort of things can't work. That, that can't work. That is not that, that, that is not how we want it. We want to see consistent um, performance from these guys. So that is how it finished off my viewers and subscribers. As I said, I'm not going to keep this one too long. Just wanted to drop this one as soon as the game you know, finished. So you guys, if you didn't get a chance to watch the game or see the live, you can have an idea of how we lost the game. So we lost it by one run. Some brainless cricket was played. So we're going to be uh, tuning in Wednesday to see how things will go. But we're going to leave this one right here for now. Sports to the bone. Keeping you informed. Please remember to like, share. Leave us a comment, guys, if you have not yet subscribed. Also remember to subscribe to the channel. I'm out.